blogger? Just the person I wanted to see. I was reading about the fascinating story of the internet, but I could not make head or tail of how it works. Can you simplify it for me? Why not, Goggle? The internet in one sentence is a huge worldwide network of millions of computers. As you know, it provides various services including email, file sharing, online gaming, advertising, marketing and many more. It has today become a very important medium for communication, research and exchange of information. Any idea which is one of its most popular uses? Email? You got it! Let us take up some common terms associated with the internet. The first is an ISP. You require an ISP or an internet service provider to help you access the internet and the services it offers. Then we need a modem. Modem is short for modulator demodulator. It lets users connect their computer to other computers using either wired or wireless connections in order to transmit and receive data. A web page is a document written in HTML. What's HTML toggle? HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language. It is the computer language for all documents that you wish to put up on the internet. These HTML documents on the internet can be read by us with the help of a program called a web browser. A web browser reads the HTML code, follows the instructions in the code and displays the documents or web pages on a computer screen in a form which the users can read. A collection of web pages with related information is called a website. This book also mentions something called the World Wide Web. What is that? The World Wide Web or simply the web is a worldwide collection of web pages stored on computers connected to the internet which anyone can access including you and me. This has helped to popularize the internet. The web is actually only a part of the internet. And what is a URL toggle? Each website or web page on the internet has a unique address which is called its URL. The URL is the unique address identifying a web page or website on the internet. There are two ways to assign an address to a website or web page. Number addressing and letter addressing. In the number addressing system, the URL is a numeric address called the Internet Protocol or IP address. It is made up of four numbers in the range 0 to 255, joined together by periods. For example, 192.12.148.73. In the letter addressing system, also called the domain name system or DNS, the URL consists of letters, for example, pakistan.gov.pk and hotmail.com. These addresses are also called domain names. The last three letters of the domain name are important because they provide information about the kind of organization to which the address belongs. These are some of the abbreviations used. The letter addressing system also uses two-letter country codes. For example, US stands for the United States, CN stands for China, and PK for Pakistan. Right. So, is the internet much clearer now, Goggle? Oh, yes, very much so. Can't wait to learn some more.